All right, we're gonna fly the Synergy 696 on V bar, V control. Um, last time I flew this, I decided this was the best flying 700 I own. I thought I liked it better than the Logo 700, but that could have been the new heli uh, feel. Um, looks superb in the air. Uh, let's give it a go. I'm gonna fly the Logo uh, 700 right after this. Got some battery charging. Let's see which one I like better. Tailgating can come down. Oh my god, that's beautiful. Try to get over here. Oh man. Oh, it's fucking nice. A little more touchy today on the cyclic than the logo was feeling wise yesterday. So it's like I need some expo or something. But tail's at the right rate. That's at the right rate. That's at the right rate I like. This thing's a fucking beast. Uh, in the air, it feels a little lower, lighter than a logo, probably because I have, I think, like four more ounces of bullshit on the logo. Way heavier ESC, battery backup. This is just pure heli right here. I can weigh them after and see. This has shitty plastic tail blades, but tail is pretty nice. This seems a little quieter than the logo in the air. I'm not going to do the backwards loop test on the tail. It gets out of control quickly. Uh, I'll do that in a big field later for you guys. I'll be probably in Pennsylvania in April for Easter. Man, is this thing quick. Power to spare. Now this is not an equal um, test because this thing's running the uh, Rotortech Ultimate 700s. These are powerful blades, man. They're, they have the lift of the VTX without the shitty cyclic feel, and that's just my opinion. Yours may be different, and that's fine. But I do not like VTX blades whatsoever. Uh, battery tray on this is eh, pretty good, just like the logo. You can adjust CG on it without moving your packs, so it's really cool. Um, it's at 1400 RPM, just like the logo. Logo has a little more visibility in there. Has the orange in the towel and a lot more solid colors on the canopy. I'm gonna turn that tail optimizer on. The gain's a little too high. With the V bar, you can just do that all automatically. Uh, things I like better about the logo: carbon frames. Uh, all three servos are easy to get in and out without disassembling anything. You cannot do that on the logo or the rear servo. You have to take the frames apart. Um, simple construction on this one. Giant skids, giant. So fantastic for like, um, for your autos and such. Order idle. Let's do one right now. Let's do it in reverse. Uh, this one has a float 
forever. It seems to have a lot less uh, well, drag than the Motorola. Logo 700. <sighs> it's got a torque tube, so does the logo, but this is all gear drive torque tube. The logo is a belt to gear. This one just seems a lot more better. It's quieter, that's for sure. This one seems more. Rescue star. Try rescue. Here. Rescue and it. Rescue star. Um, rescue and This one seems it. more playful, a little looser in the air. Logo is a little more planted. To be honest, I, I kind of really liked that feel yesterday. The logo. This one's not giving me that confidence of the logo yesterday. Even though it feels more playful. Again, these could just be settings, could be blades. This thing sounds really good in the air, though. Fucking incredible. Love those green tail rotor blades. I mean, you can see them like they're a disc. In the sun is just fucking awesome. The motor I have in here is some Scorpion limited edition black. I don't know what it feels like. Endless power. There's not a hint of bog. Stops aren't as crisp. Could be the RPM. As my uh, my Diablo 600, if you did that, it would would it fucking stop like it would stop like it hit a brick wall. It was so cool. That of course the Diablo had uh um what was it? It had a uh this kind of DFC had um no dampening. Zero. So it probably had a lot to do with it. That was the sharp handling heli, a little heavy for a 600. Um, approaching seven minutes, so probably go to eight or nine, but I don't want to stress the battery pack. It's, it's a newer pack. Come in for the last few seconds, just some expo and stuff. Let's get this handling a little. I'm gonna land on a solid piece of snow there, so when I take off. Let me bump the expo. There we go, we were at 15. Tail optimizer is on. So I just added some expo. Reduce the uh, speed on the. Uh, yeah, that feels a lot better. That's a damn uh, touchy. And that's what I mean about comparing Hallies. Like, are your settings the same? You're running the same blades, same motor, same size packs, weight. What the hell is that noise out there? Yeah, this is a pretty badass Hallie, man. Like a weird noise out there. Halloween.
Um, tail's held strong. I mean, I'm not doing anything, but... Oh, it's a three-wheeler, four-wheeler out there. That's what that is. All right. Logo battery should be done. There's an airplane way up there. Beautiful uh, head on this thing and tail. The silver parts, just gorgeous. Gorgeous Holly. Look at that thing, it's just beautiful. Fucking beautiful. That tail sounds mean. I got the speed up pulley. Oh, the tail. It's fucking sweet. So that was nine minutes of flight. 